all right what is going on youtube back again uh with skull servants and it's the last duel of the day and as you can see we're going up against a pie by yan um or however you say it i i don't know you might have some uh, weird stuff going on with it the pronunciation not, not weird stuff but yeah you guys understand what i'm saying so as you can see we opened up pretty okay it's not 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 really the greatest of hands but it's a okay hand i would say in the least because we can easily establish deco talker we can also go link spider uh and a uh what's the name and a um a omega um this is where i was thinking right here should i do that actually because i could have just summoned white princess and use gofu as a token i mean use gofu uh for a tuner so i can go into um going to omega but then i opted against it because i'm like you know what the link spiders really aren't i mean they're just serving no purpose in the deck um they're just going to pretty much be sitting there because when am i ever going to bring out another gofu i don't think it's going to happen so i decided to just go into the link spider again so i can go into the deco talker and uh here uh at, after this play actually i was thinking hmm, we should probably be playing mrs radiant because with mrs radiant we could still establish an omega and we could have had a we could have had um omega and uh you know a, a link to that points uh down you know downward so i mean you guys understand we're pointing to the center and to the side uh so we can definitely still have the pretty much the same links as deco talker and for less and still get a you know still be able to use gofu as a tuner but yeah, that's pretty much all my plays because you know my hand is not the greatest hand should all show future can't be used on nothing so i'm like all right um hopefully he can go into a uh a, a extra deck monster a link of his own or maybe even something like a, a synchro or something so we can definitely use this shadow fusion um i'm pretty sure he's going to take advantage of my deco talker um so he asking how much attack it is and yes it is at 2800 some macaroos deco talker is because you do have one pointed to it and this combo is really good because not only can i tribute white princess to negate uh, a targeting uh, effect i can also tribute white princess herself by herself with her own effect so i can reduce the uh what's the name the attack and defense of uh you know of car uh, i think levels right i don't know if it counts ranks i think it does count rank but uh, i think th i don't think it does let's see does it i don't know we i went skipped over it way too fast but uh yeah with well, white princess effect we contribute her and then deco talker doesn't lose anything because it does not have a level and so yeah here he goes going into a i believe a force tricks right here to search and here is where i actually got a little worried because i'm like damn he you know you know when black when uh not black wings but when raid raptors get going uh they can get going and especially since he has the extra link he can i mean extra zone he can use for a special summon he can definitely you know get some plays off me what i was worried about it was him going into that 3500 dude that uh that's unaffected by anything because i don't believe we we have to get multiple we have to get king of the skull servants on board with you know four thousand maybe even five thousand attack so we can get over anything he like you know to get over that monster but I, that that card really scared me that felt like you know that would be a very bad situation to be doing so he decides to end his turn and then i said all right fuck it. i'm just gonna activate this shadow fusion i don't care he may have something down there so i asked him uh, does he have a response he says okay so i'm like all right so here we go now i'm thinking what should i go into i was thinking uh a grista but i was like this is not good because i was going to send sage um and then i was thinking Sh shakanaga but what am i gonna i mean what i'm sending mizuki and i ain't got no targets end up going with a window because now i can dump two darks and i'm gonna end up picking a shadow beast and a shadow dragon so i can pop a card and get to draw a card which would be very you know it's going to be very good for uh what's the name then he changed igris attack and i'm like what i'm like dude what do you do it like you if you icarus attacked before that um should all fusion wouldn't resolve uh you would see my hand uh and it would have been like downhill from there for me because like i would have just been stuck with a deco talker and really nothing else but yeah he played it the way he wanted to play it then he tries to activate raptor's force 
which uh, cannot be activated because nothing was destroyed. He tributed the monster. So now I'm just like, all right, we need, if we can draw a good card, we can possibly get game because Deco Tarka is going to go to 33. Window would be at 30, 22. So that's what? That's a uh, 52. Uh, yeah, we have exactly, actually, wait, whoa, I said it's 55. So we do already have game because we do have a Spirit Master in a top deck into a hand structure. So I'm like, all right, you might as well just, you know, I'm using it right here. I'm not really thinking about how much attack is on board. I'm thinking of, all right, how can I, <clears throat> how can I uh, kill him? Because uh, I, I think I'm going to need a lot more attack. So use the hand destruction, discarding the dead cards in my hand. Uh, end up drawing into two of the best cards in the deck, which is Sage and a Scorpio. I'm like, oh my God, that's just saucy right there, man. That's just... <laughs> I said, you can't go wrong with that, man. So a normal summon Scorpio. And here I'm thinking I, may, I can exceed after this. But then, like, everything kicked in. It's like, I, wait a minute. I have a window on board. I can't do anything past this Scorpio. So I used the Scorpio um, to go ahead and get Cobra. And Cobra is going to search the, uh, what's the name? The El Shadal Fusion because just in case this man does have some crazy stuff to get over the window. Or maybe even next turn, we can definitely just go Grista. Uh, we can go Grista and then use Winda to add back a Shadal card to the hand. And then, you know, like I said, Grista has uh, his own effect to negate some summons. So, <clears throat> that's what I'm going to do here. I'm going to search the El Shadal Fusion. And I believe, uh, yeah, just go to attack because I'm like, alright, I, I, I have game. I check his graveyard. And this is where uh, I was like, oh, shit, he could have discarded the trap card and literally saved his life. But, yeah, that ended up being the duel. Not really too close, but, you know, it's still, still pretty cool. Still pretty cool, I guess. Um, so, yeah, we do get a win with Skull Servants and stuff like that. And as you can see, uh, yeah, man, our rating went up by 22, so that's good. And here is the deck list for today um this is the deck i have been uh, using shout outs to random ix for sending in the deck list and if you guys want to support the channel all i ask for you guys to do is click and add which would be very helpful and you know i appreciate it very much so yeah man <clears throat> you want to see me play this deck again leave it in the comments below a different deck uh go ahead and send it to me i prefer ydk files much easier for me to just import and stuff like that so i don't mess up any cards or something like that and yeah that's it for today uh once again thank you for watching and uh yeah i will see you guys tomorrow